Nakapere Pirit is one of the remotest districts in northeastern Uganda, bordered by Kwen from the southern Amudat in the north, having been carved out of Moroto district. It's accessed through Kwen district with impassable roads, especially during the rainy seasons, and this has kept the district behind in terms of growth almost in all sectors. These peoples of Lemusui Primary School under this tree shed and attending classes paints a clear picture of many schools in the district. These are not only interrupted by rain during learning, but also obstructed by objects that may pass while they are in class. <laughs> According to teachers here, when clouds start forming as a sign of rain, classes are combined into one and under one roof. Most of these children are in the villages simply because the place where they come from is far and they are unable to be going home and coming up to school. As you see, the school has few structures and the the population of children are increasing every day. Population. Around 450, 450. For years, pupils have been learning on empty stomachs, but thanks to the World Food Program that has donated maize and beans, which is prepared for lunch, things have improved. But due to lack of funds to mill the maize, maize is prepared in its raw form together with beans, and it is never enough for pupils. In its programs, the Ministry of Education and Sports has just posted teachers across the country and Lemsui Primary School happens to have benefited. But this has come with a number of challenges including teachers' accommodation with only these two stances as an accommodation facility for nine staff. Miss living hands because we keep on shifting <laughs> from one room to another. Somebody is having a woman for us. We need one room for those ones who are married to occupy at least one room. Then the other room is for those ones who are unmarried. With such a deplorable conditions within Akapiri Piriti district, chances are slim that people here will ably compete academically with their counterparts in schools with better facilities.